Hey guys, Call Game 72 here, and today we are going to be grinding money, preparing for update 4.6, which is launching tomorrow morning. It is exciting. Um, I'm using my laptop to stream. So I don't know how this will look. If it looks awful, I'm just not going to stream, and I apologize. My computer is put away. But, uh, yeah. Let me do a quick look around and see if it looks good. Wait for it to come up on stream. Come on, stream. Come on, stream. You can do it. Oh, no. It's really choppy, guys, but you know what? We might just have to let it go. Is it? Yeah, I'm using my laptop. My PC is put away, packed up, getting ready to move. I'm moving right as soon, right as this update is coming out. It's pretty, I'm, I'm a little annoyed. I mean, it's fine, but it's like, no, I wish I still had my PC, because then I could stream no problem. But it is what it is. It's watchable, you think so? All right, well, I'll stream it then. I'll just stream. And people can watch if they want to. When is the update coming out? Tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning indeed. And we are just getting ready for it. I can't shrink this. Okay. There we go. So, unfortunately, I forgot to bring my intros over to this computer. So, no intros. But I'll still be releasing videos just without intros. Um, I think I'm, I'm going to finally release a video tomorrow it's been a while yes it's the 5a the super conqueror all sorts of things all sorts of things um nerfs buffs one of the things i'm most annoyed with okay is um, okay the liberté is going to get a slight gun handling nerf on the move which is i guess fine this tank is pretty op considering what it does um and they don't usually nerf premium tanks so i'm kind of glad that they're willing to do that um but the big thing, my opinion, is they are nerfing the gun handling and the rate of fire of the slapjack. Yes, you heard me. They are nerfing the slapjack. They are nerfing the big top, and they are nerfing the stubs. Yeah, you get to update now. That way when it comes out tomorrow, it's immediate. So they're nerfing these three tanks, and it doesn't make any sense because they're awful already. <laughs> so there you go. Congratulations, guys. Apparently the numbers say they're too OP. I guess they're winning too much. Well, I mean, of course they're winning too much. Only good players have them right now, duh. Right? Because they're a long grind. All right. Well, we're going to make money. I think how are we going to start things off? Well, we're going to start the things off right. We have one X2 Silver Boost. And yes, the game is going to be a little bit choppy guys. I think we're getting 20 FPS. See, as you can see like this. And I apologize for that. All right. This is nothing I can do about it. This computer is awful. Unless you want me to go down to 480p, which would just be even worse than it is now. But uh No, well, here we go. Oh, one of my favorite buffs which I read they're buffing the E75's top speed to set, uh, 40 like they did on PC, but they're not going to nerf its engine like they did on PC. So it's going to go 40 with its 1200 horsepower engine. That is so exciting. I'm excited about that. And yes, speeds through the Super Conqueror as well. And we have, we should have enough XP on the Conqueror. We have 300,000. We have 200,000 on the 115A, and we almost have 30,000 free XP. So I think I have enough to get the 5A and the Super Conqueror right away tomorrow. And tomorrow, I'm going to be streaming again. And I'm going to try to get, see what settings I can do on here to get it so that it streams at 30 FPS. So I might try OBS, but we'll see. But uh, I'm going to stream as soon as the update comes out. So I'm going to go to bed today early and then wake up early in the morning and play the update right away. And then I have... That way people in Australia can watch. 
and then, but don't be like, oh no, I'm gonna miss a stream because you guys have to sleep. Don't don't think that. No, no, no. Then I have a doctor's appointment early in the morning, and then when I get back, I'll stream again. So I'll have two streams tomorrow, and we'll just be playing all the the new stuff, playing the buffs, playing the Super Conqueror, playing the 5A. So that's what we'll be doing. When's the badger coming out? I have no idea. I wouldn't be surprised if it's not long. <clears throat> it probably I wouldn't be surprised if it's for Christmas, some kind of big update for Christmas. Because this is coming out this update is coming out mid year, right? September. I mean it's it's yeah, it's closer to the end than the middle. Well, it's closer to the end than the start, but it's still right right by the mid year, so they can still come out with another big update for sure. And I won't be surprised if the badger comes out for Christmas or something. The medium zoo. There's a lot of mediums. Maxwell Murray. You mean the medium that's yellowing? Is that you? And then regretting his decision immediately? Oh, medium nerfs. Oh, yep, yep. So you did read that. Um, it was translated from Russia, so we'll see exactly what it comes of it. I've, I've, I've looked at it, and a lot of the the nerfs... I don't know, dude. Like, the bat chat is definitely, I feel, an abused tank. It really is, so I, I think a little bit of a reload nerf. I don't think it's really going to do anything, because you still have to reload, and you'll just hide while you reload. You just It just means you hide longer, right? So I don't think that'll really affect the bat chat. But yeah, some of the updates were a little bit definitely like okay some of the nerfs um i did like what they did with the 30b and the prototype because they nerfed their premium rounds which means they might nerf other tanks premium rounds um and something they didn't mention there was they buffed their turret armor and nerfed their gun handling they didn't mention the uh reload buff and i'm pretty sure the french mediums are going to get a reload buff so don't you worry about that it's gonna the tanks are still gonna be just fine. Dang it. I, I would have would have been able to hit that guy if this type sixty one didn't decide to back into me. And prevent me from pushing up. Well. Alright, let's just go side scrape that E4. Oh, uh, M103 is shooting heat. Oh, Artie, why you have to do this? Oh, this is just a cluster of a cluster of a cluster. Every shot we fire in pen is um, an insane amount of money when you have double on. Ah. Oh. Oh, 50B, go away. Oh, already go away. Why did he shoot me out of all those tanks? That guy shot at me, too. Oh, I thought he was going to pull back, but he got tracked. What is that already? That's Oh, it's an autoloader. Still trying to shoot me. Oh, no, this is going to be a sad day. For us all. Well, just a sad day for me. Thank goodness that guy got shot, not me. He still wants to poke. Something tells me that was a panther too. Oh, I wonder where he went. He's in that bush, and that one's straight. I feel like that should have hit. That bounced off. Did you see that shoot out that way like that? So we hit him. 
They're just bouncing off, unfortunately. Oh, that one didn't want to hit. There's a was the Stark. He's not there anymore. Oh no, there's a Stark. That was the T30 that got nuked. No 50B. Some of us want to do damage too, you know. I only have four pet. See, this is these are the games I hate. I hate these games where your team just you're in a slow tank. And your team just said, "Da, we win." The enemy team, you guys all lose. Okay. These are my least favorite games. They really make me sad. Oh, hello, welcome. The stream is coming out tomorrow morning, early in the morning, and I'm going to be streaming it right when it comes out. So like three in the morning for me, or something like that. But uh, I'm going to be going to bed early today so I can stream it. Yes. He's running. I'm going to be able to shoot this guy as long as the C4 doesn't flip and nuke him. Damage, 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 damage. Keep driving, keep driving, keep driving. We did damage! That's like 20,000 right there, guys, because of the uh, the boost. Yeah. But this is going to be still good. This is probably going to be uh, almost 100,000, if not 100,000, with a double. So we are preparing, we are grinding money to make sure we can buy ourselves a Super Conqueror in a 5A tomorrow morning. Ah, see, 150,000 with a double, that's not bad. Oh, well, I guess it is. I can make 150,000 easy mode in this tank without it. Just, I just need to make sure my team doesn't, like, this looks like it was a tier 6 game almost. <laughs> the amount of damage done on the team. Mm. Unfortunately, we never stopped driving. But, it was not enough. So, anyway, um, how did that look gameplay-wise, guys, with this new... Not this new, but with my old laptop, since I had to take down my PC, I have to ask now. Because I can't see my stream. I, I stopped it. Closed that window. I just have the pop-out, just to speed up. Just so that I don't have more things, unnecessary things, open on my computer. So, how did that look? Was that awful? Was it okay? You know, you guys tell me. Was it watchable? Was it like off? Oh, really frustrating watching the frame rate. It looked fine. Okay, good. Just making sure, because my PC's packed away, and then I'm going on vacation next week. Well, kind of. I'm just settling into my house and I've decided to just call it vacation and so I won't be streaming or releasing videos probably for two weeks after this week and then I'll have my computer set up and I'll have really good internet and I might be able to stream at 1080 guys oh <gasps> doesn't that sound amazing oh boy okay so we got to get this crew to 100% because this is our centurion crew and we don't have a video for the centurion one yet all right and we need to get the Centurion 1 video before tomorrow. So we can have a 4.5 video for you guys. 25%. And I'm not really grinding any tanks right now. So what we're going to do is we are going to turn on our times twos. And just get through it. And we're going to turn on 30,000 win 10 battles. We're going to turn that on. And we're going to turn on, um, doesn't combine with first win, doesn't combine with first win, hmm, what else we got in here, damage five or more, good, 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 and, and this, this one won't combine with first win, but it'll be fine after, alright, let's grind this crew, here we go, and make money at the same time, that's the plan. Now, unfortunately, another thing about using the laptop is it cannot handle me recording in 1080 either, which means any games I get while playing this on here will unfortunately have to be 720. They're going to be 720 as well, but they'll still be they'll still be the maximum FPS, so that's fine. Well, 30, but this game is only 30 anyway.
So we gotta hope. We gotta hope we have decent games. Like we can have good games, some aces, but we can't have any ten thousand damage games. I refuse. I refuse. We must save those for ten eighty. Otherwise, my computer will die. Wow. That's right. Now I remember why I have a bunch of preferential tanks ready to go is because the tens right now are ridiculous. Good evening. Good evening, Marnus. Twenty-eight people watching. Look at that, look at that. Even with the crappier graphics than usual. Twenty-eight of you fine gentlemen. Maybe not all of you are gentlemen. Are out there watching today. So seven point five second reload with a seventy five percent crew but full equipment. My view range is awful even with optics. But do not worry. It will be good. Where do we want to go? I have an idea. But first, let's pull a little to the right so we don't get shot by whoever's right there. There we go. Fantastic. There's no artillery, so this might actually work. So today we're just doing money, 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 money. And then we're going to switch over to the Centurion 1 and try to get a good, a good video. Out of my way, sir. A good replay from that. I almost, I almost derped that. Hi, ISU shooting HE. That's interesting. This gun's handle is still really nice. T fifty four E one. Oh dang it! Guy snapped me. I don't think we can spot this ISU unless he shoots. I could be wrong though. No, I think we can spot him. Unfortunately, that motherland is quite annoying where he is. But well, I'm sure we're more annoying because he has to hit us in their cupola. There you go. He did find a shot actually into our. We poked too far around. I think if we go like this, this might work a little better. Two can play this side scrape game. Yeah, buddy. What's it like? Oh, this ISU, though. E gosh. And that guy's snap ability. Look at. I don't know how that. Look at that. Where he hit. And my tank needs to stop driving forward and backward. See, look, I'm not, I'm not touching the controller, but it is. So, unfortunately, I've had no support. And this Mudland has gotten exceedingly lucky. Exceedingly. And that is... Hello. I salute you. As I die. Oh boy. You way over angle, buddy. <sighs> but it doesn't matter. We are dead. No, the M60 is not coming. It is the M48A5 Patton is coming, along with um, a bunch of turret buffs. It didn't say; it just said some. Let me let me go back to this website real quick. The rebalancing of some tanks. Okay, so this isn't all of them. It didn't mention anything about the heavy tanks, the British heavy tanks, but it did mention the, um, oh, it doesn't even mention the Centurion 1, sorry, but they're buffing the Huntsman and the Atomic, oh, I'm sure they're buff if they're buffing the Huntsman and the Atomic, they're buffing the Centurion 1, this just says some, 
And in the FE4202P, it says it improves the turret, but it doesn't say to what extent. So, and this was translated from Russia. So this is a little bit like, you know, okay. Um, it's, it's, it's trying its best. It doesn't say everything. Okay, but, I know, I'm being confusing. So the, definitely the Centurion 7-1 is getting a turret buff. Uh, so is the Action X, and so is the FE4202P. So is the M4885 Batten. And T95 is getting a mobility nerf, just this turning. Yep. But then there's a lot of things. A lot, a lot of things in here. But anyway, let's go down to... Let's play some preferentials. I'm sick of 10s right now, because that's all we've gotten so far today, is 10s. So let's play an STA2. But yeah, it's, uh, there's a lot in this update. What's the gun on the? It's it's the same gun. You're talking about the. Uh, oops, they are getting rid of the two stock guns on the patent too. They're like, they're like, why 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 do you need to grind at tier ten? So getting rid of those. So when you get yourself a patent, you don't have to grind. You just get it. Boom. So anyone who's grinding that, that's gonna be nice. It gets to 105. Um, there are some patch notes. Let me get them. I don't know why I haven't put them in the description. Copy. I'm going to put them right in the description right now. Oh, i got to open up YouTube then. No, YouTube. It's This computer is so slow. Excuse me, I just sneezed. I'm still waiting for my YouTube to load, so... It will load eventually, in the meantime. Let's continue to drive. Oh, there we go. Clicking on my Creator Studio. It will load eventually. Do, do, do. Still waiting. Don't worry. It'll, it'll load. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. Don't worry. We will get it. That's weird that you're there, buddy. Like, that's actually really weird that you're there. I'm, I'm just going to RBRT because... I have not yet, dude. I have not yet. Just... My, I haven't been even on in a while doing anything because I just got my laptop set. Oh my gosh, this is so stupid. Okay, I'm pasting it in. It's right below the main description. And I pasted it. There we go. All changes saved. Okay, it should be there if you refresh this. Refresh the, the stream. It should be there. It should. I could be wrong, but it should be there. Okay. Gosh dang, this computer is awful. I don't know what happened to it. It used to be decent, but now it's just awful. I think Windows updates. Typical, the usual. You guys know how it is. But yep, if you refresh the stream, it should be there. The new balances are horrible? Why? Just because... We'll see. I mean, it's the translation is pretty bad. Definitely pretty bad. So we'll see exactly how much of it is. How it is supposed to be. And what isn't. Really, dude? Like, I kind of want him to 1v1 me, though. No, he kind of doesn't want to, though. He's like, nope. Alright, this medium tank seems to want to fight me. And I seem to not want to fight him. Knock out his engine. We have to keep our DPM going. Our gun singing. What the heck kind of a gun do you have? Or did the snake bite shoot me just a moment ago? I think the snake bite shot me. 
There we go, GG. It was fun, buddy. It was fun. There we go. There we go. We killed the we killed the snake bite. It's whatever. It's all good. It's all good. We had to shoot the snake bite because we wouldn't have been able to kill the T29, so the snake bite was a better option. Do I do damage to a tank we can't kill? But hey, you know what? We might have pushed up a little too far. I wasn't expecting the T29 to come down. I thought the T29 was a little bit dumb. He actually does have three kills though. But he was just sitting here, so he was a little bit dumb. But that's gotta be more money for us. Oh, I won't be able to watch it, dude. My everything is awful. Oh wait, did you send it in the message? Oh you did. Hmm. This guy says the RU sucks. The RU is getting a buff. I don't know what this is from. I have all these messages, but I haven't been on. Oh, he snapshot me. I played a little bit two days ago. I don't know why it says yesterday. Oh, this is from... Oh, you suck. Yes, it does. I mean, I guess we can watch it live. Hmm. Alright, we'll watch it. But I gotta get to grinding. Don't you want me to save it, though, for a video, if it is really good? I should save it for a video. We actually won this? Oh, we captured the base. Lol. 6,000 experience. Nice. 100,000 credits. Nice. String theory. What a shame. I won't forget, dude. Don't worry. I have everybody's replays. But right now, I've got to grind. Can't watch replays. Oh, to be silly. Alright, come on. Give us a top tier. But first, I want to see how 6,000 experience did to the crew. 18%. Okay. Okay. Couple good games. Couple good games. Oh, hello, Jordan. I should use the, the big map. It's better. It's better rarely. And I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why it's better rarely. Why the small one is better more often. It's because the big one is easy enough to open up with one click of a button, right? You can just click your back button. And you can open it. And you can see this, right? Boom. And you can see where the enemy are. You can see where you, your team is. But mostly where your team is, right? And where your team is spotting. So, and if you have time to... And that's usually I just use for changing flanks. Seeing which flank I want to go to. Which means I'm not fighting at that moment in time. So I have time to look at the big map. Meanwhile, if I am fighting in someone, I want the small map. Because I want to notice people appear on my right or appear on my left immediately. Notice if they're in close proxy to me. So right now I'm going to look at the big map, yes. And then at the start of the game, I'm probably going to be looking at the big map. Just to see where my tanks go. Like, ooh, one's going left, one's going right, you know, that kind of a thing. But then once I get to the fight, I'd rather have the small one. And then once I win my fight or I need to run away, and I'm not shooting anything, then I have time to just look at the, the big map. See? So that's why I use a small map. I don't think there's a re need to have this big one open all the time, because you can just do this and have the same exact picture. So I like having the small one, because now I can have both of them. You don't need to see what's happening when you're fighting. Yes, you can see. I actually have a video where... Um, a couple of videos where the small map saved my life because somebody appeared on my small map, it was a Death Star, and he appeared and I noticed him right away and I was just able to tell where I needed to go without actually having to look and I drove and the shell missed me by mere millimeters. So. But it is all opinion. And if you go watch Turkey Tanker or any other of the Super Unicums, you'll see they all use the they all use the big one, the small one. I mean, 
So there is a method to using the small one. A lot of super unicums use the small one. Most super unicums I know use the small one. And there's a reason for that. There is a reason for that, which most people don't realize. But I think it's hilarious. I've got a lot of people who, in the comment section saying I'm an idiot for using the small map. My response to them usually is, I'll tell you what, once you get 64% win rate, I'll, once you pass me with win rate, I'll switch, I'll switch, uh, I'll switch maps. Dang it, if we attract that guy, which is what I wanted, it would have been pretty glorious. Oh, we can't pen that E100. Well, you can pen that, except we hit his gun. See, with this small map, I can see exactly where this guy, this medium tank is, and I'll know exactly when he can shoot me. Meanwhile, with the big one, it's a little more confusing, like, to tell in proximity where he is to, s to find shots. While with this, the small one, I can see exactly what angle he has on me. Try to hit him in the tracks there. Hey, we pinned. See. There we go. I love this spot. But anyway, that's just my take on it. I know I, the big map is definitely better for some. I just don't like it when people come in. You were fine. Yours was your 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 comment was fine. You know why don't you use the bigger one? It's better. You know that's fine or whatever it was you said. Um, but I have people who just come in and just straight out call me an absolute moron for using the small one. And the, like like that shot was pretty bad. I aimed way too low. But you know everybody has definitely their strengths and weaknesses and I definitely agree that for some people the the big one is definitely better and they might be able to read it quicker I can't I don't read it quick enough because I also do have uh, dyslexia and so telling left and right quickly in perspective of where I am is definitely a little bit harder than some dang it Like, right there with the small map, I should have noticed him a little bit quicker than with the big map. But unfortunately, I was aiming down my sights, and... Yeah, that's just not gonna work. And I'm dead. I can't run from this. Yep. So unfortunately, I, not I did notice... I did notice, I kept looking at my big map and you saw that, I noticed that uh, a lot of their TDs weren't spotted. I didn't think that they were all pushing down this area. I thought they were going to be sitting up here, which is why I never poked up the middle. I should have poked the middle, noticed nobody was there, and then gone this way. So even if I had the big map, I wouldn't have noticed them coming in like this. Because they were tank destroyers, I just assumed they'd be camping, because that's what they do. The Agpanzer? Like... What is the Agpanzer E100? It's a big tank with a big gun. We don't have one on our team, though. It's got 170. And it does a lot of damage. You saw it, two shot me. That's what it does. Hello. Hello from America.
That's time to improve the 5k stats. Easy mode, dude. Alright, I didn't get good at this game until I think it was 13,000 battles. I finally realized, oh wait a minute, I can actually play this game competently, competitively. <laughs> it took me forever. Um. So, it took me a long time. And then it wasn't until I started watching YouTube that I figured out started to figure out the game as well. Um, I used to watch Quickie Baby, and then I stopped. And I what I would do instead was watch. Uh, I would just type in the tank I was currently grinding for, and then I would search it. So I'd be like Leopard One, um, Epic Game or something like that, Epic Replay. And then what would come up is usually this guy whose YouTube account was World of Tanks Epic Replays. And he just posts epic games. A lot of the time they're premium spammers because um, he just posts games with high damage. But that taught me a lot. And I know a lot of times when you do that much damage, you're lucky. But it still taught me positioning. Um, it taught me um, where the tanks can be used. Um, especially since it was the tank I was grinding for. And it taught me all sorts of stuff. And so... Watching people just have monster games really helps because, granted, it's like, okay, he was really lucky, but at the same time, when somebody has a monster game, they're usually not in one spot. So you get to learn all sorts of positions with that one replay. And so that's how I think I learned the game, was watching watching those games. And our team is stacked. Unfortunately, and by stacked, I mean tank-wise. Like, holy cow, that's a lot of hit points. Unfortunately, the cap circle is out in the field. So, um, we'll see if that matters for our heavy tanks. Oh, who, who's who am I? Got a, got a what? Are, what now? Who are you? I should ban you. Oh, and also, with the more people we get watching, the more trolls we get. So there you go. Oh boy. So unfortunately, there's been this uh, a little bit of this lag where watch when I push forward. Oh, it didn't happen this time, of course, when I say it. But a lot of times your tank doesn't want to stop, and I don't know why that is. And I thought that was just me, me lag, me, me, my controller was broken. I just assumed that was the case. But I got uh, a message from a couple other people, uh, and a couple other people in the clan were letting me know that it's not just me, it's been happening to them. It's where the tank... Look, at, see, it's still going. And now it stopped. So it's really weird. Because it's not lag, I've got five bars, it's not my controller. My controller works fine on everything else. And then now it's happening to other people. So. We'll see. We'll see. It is what it is. Oh, hello there. Dang it. But yeah, this tank is going to get a little bit of a nerf. Gun handling wise. And unfortunately we missed that. Oh, but we hit that. So, you know. GG. But let's get up into these guys' faces. Because they don't have any big tanks other than that meal. But he's preoccupied. We can probably feast on these guys. As long as I don't pull what that hole and hound pulled. Oh. This guy actually has 13 degrees of gun depression when he's using that turret. He just has a bad gun. A gun which can't pen me, I don't think. I don't think any of these guys can really pen me. Obviously, I think the KV-85 might be able to with his gun. But it's not going to be consistent. I mean, unless he shoots me in my butt. But, like, our armor is decent. And it's decent enough to troll lower tiers, definitely. Especially when you're coming with a small gun. I don't think that was artillery. I think that was the, the map itself. I came around that corner a little too wide. Oh, he actually penned that. Was I too wide again? I don't think so. No, he's penning me, but for some reason the KV-85 isn't. Definitely not expected. There we go, now I got my front to him. Now we're gonna shoot this KV-85. I lost way too many hit points. Oh, he's looking at me! You've got other tanks in front of you, but he's still looking at me. Dang it. A lot of hit points unnecessarily lost there. But you know what? We pushed the fight. I guess I actually, I definitely didn't have to push the fight because we had these heavy tanks coming. But they were taking too long. Like, seriously. Look at this platoon of heavy tanks. And they were fighting nothing but sixes and sevens. And it took them that long. Hmm. 
I do I do not want to be mean, but like when you're you, they shouldn't be stopping, in my opinion. They shouldn't be stopping. They should just continue to roll. Because what can stop them? Okay, there's a scorpion. That can stop them, and it can stop me, so... I'm going back into the town. Excuse me. Somebody's got to reset that base. It's going to be me, isn't it? Oh, good. Something else. Oh, it's a charioteer in there. Okay, good thing I didn't poke them. That would have hurt. But he shouldn't be looking at me now. Let's reset you. There we go. Yeah, we should win this. No problem. What is that? A lichen? I'm not liking what you're doing to me. <laughs> oh, charioteer, don't shoot me, please. Don't shoot me, don't shoot me. I didn't realize the M came out. When did that come out? Or has that been out and I've just not been paying any attention? Uh, probably been out. I just haven't been paying attention. Chariot here is dead. Who's the last guy in there? Was it? Oh, there he is. Oh, not quite high enough roll. There we go. It's an STA too. There we go. And all that's left is you. Wait for my guy to go first, and he fired. I can't get my gun down! Don't worry, we can, we'll can. we beat the reload here. Ah, but we won't beat the other reload. Dang it, I underestimated the reload. Unfortunately, there. Can you stop grinding into me? Thank you. It's very kind of you. Very kind of you. He's gonna shoot me like it was me. Is that lag from Wargaming? Yes, it is. Do not worry. It's not you. That lag is Wargaming. I don't know if it's lag. I don't think it's actually lag, though. That's the weird thing. Um, and let me show you something. This is going to be really weird. And I've had this happen to me a couple of times, and it's gotten me killed. And I recorded it. I was I went into a, a Proving Grounds and started testing it out and seeing if I could get it to happen again. And it did happen again. And here it is. This is where I start driving. And then... But for some reason, it doesn't want to go into the top gear. And so here's an example. This tank goes 42, or 41. As you can see, it's going, you know, normal speeds. And then I stop. And now look. Ready? It doesn't want to stop. See? And there, now it stops. And then when I go, it's in a lower gear. Look at, look how slow it's going. Look, and you can see the arrow. It's only halfway up. So then I stop my tank again. And then when I start going, and now the arrow is all the way up. So I don't know what that's all about. But yeah, it was really weird. So there's that. Countdown? Mm, I guess if I have to. But I'm jumping back into my Centennial. I need to finish this crew so I can play my Centurion 1. And hopefully have a game where I use my turret armor. So I'm probably going to be in a tier 10 game again. I cannot seem to get the break. Oh, I'm already gotten the string theory going. Oh, so my crew is going to grind so fast if I can win this. Have we lost today? My gosh. What what is today? What is today? Oh, my crew must be doing great then, because that means we won the game before too. Eight percent yeah, we won a ten percent. Dang. Well let's pull it out again. Which this will be good. So okay, um I don't know I'm gonna have to do countdowns a little bit better. Because on my screen, my countdown was super delayed. Super delayed. Yeah. And I don't think it got sent up before I got into a game. Oh, tell me what tier you're in? I'm only doing 8 today, so that should help you. That should help you. Yeah, 10 again. Eights, I this is gonna be tough. Once we get this crew mastered, we're gonna go straight into our Centurion seven 
or Centurion 1 and try to get that game. And then not play tanks without preferential ever again. Because <laughs> it's the 10s are ridiculous. <clears throat> but uh, what are we going to do? I think we're going to go to the same spot we went to last time. I like this spot. But yeah, you're not going to get in this game with me. My countdown didn't appear online until after I got into a game. But that's my computer for you. It's so bad. It used to be good. I gotta see how it plays Minecraft, because it used to play Minecraft great. I love Minecraft. Don't judge me. Nah, you can judge me, it's fine. What are you doing, sir? Oh, that's interesting. Okay, we're gonna go right here. So those guys can't shoot. But now we've got this 1390 pinned. Oh, see, I can't back up. Go. It's all these light tanks, man. This guy's tr decided to trade shot for shot. 13105 fell back. I can fall back too now. You can't trade shot for shot, guys, in your light tanks. Don't be this guy. He should have put two into me, if not three, before he pulled back. But uh, I've got to make a play now because there are heavy tanks as well. So we're going to just get in and bully this guy. I'm, I don't know where that shell went. But we missed. And that was my pet, poor aim, unfortunately. So, okay. Wow. The first shell said no. The second shell, my fault. But still, that was a bit dumb. I... I thought I aimed that second shell fine, but, you know, I hit behind him, so clearly I didn't. And he whips me. Holy cow, he whipped me hard. I gave him, like, maybe a quarter second to shoot me. Yeah, and this is a new crew, so good luck me. Okay, with tanks up there, they shouldn't come in from behind me anymore. I mean, I'm sure they will, but they should die for it. Right now, I just want the win. Win before anything else. So let's see if we can keep ourselves alive for a little bit. Okay. One. Two. We just need one more bounce. Three. There it is. And then the E75 going in from behind. And he gets tracked. Beautiful. Beautiful. This is amazing. Please don't whip me again. He does. Wow, that kid. He RBRT me. Mm. I would never get that lucky. Not in a million years. Because most of my tank was behind cover. So him RBRTing, which is right bumper, right trigger, would have gone, obviously, towards the center of my tank. Right. Which is below the turret on the right, to the right. But look where he hit. Right there. That was definitely the way his turret snapped, because his gun was pointing up a little bit. And you can tell when they when they RBR, when they right bumper you, because his gun went down and turned at the same time. Like that. So, unfortunately, he got exceedingly lucky. Because if his shell went straight, it would have missed. You know what I'm trying to say? But it didn't. His shell pulled to the left. Unfortunately, that was my luck there. We'll hopefully win this. This STI, I think, is... I don't know if he's making the right play, though, capturing the base right now. Because he's got to hope they don't get back in time. When he And that means sacrificing having a tank in position to... Can you hit your shots there? My gosh. Oof. My luck getting people like that on my team. But yeah, now we're down a tank fighting, if that makes any sense. AC5, though, should win his engagement. No, he shouldn't. Now he shouldn't. They all turned around. But did he hold them back long enough is the question. The question that needs to be asked. This T49 needs to keep these guys lit. 
The gorilla is going to make it in time. We just got to hope the gorilla donks his shot. He's got 30 seconds. All he needs is the gorilla to miss, and he's got it. Because this is a couple of grids. Gorilla can make it. Oh, the gorilla's not even spotted. He's going to come around the corner any second now. Got to turn your gun where they're going to come from, dude. Where's the gorilla? Where's the gorilla? He's going to come on your right. Where's the gorilla? Oh! Oh, we got it. Oh my gosh, we got it. Where did the gorilla go? Or is there no gorilla? And I'm just... No, the gorilla just didn't want to reset the base. Yeah, I, you know what? I took my life into... I bet my life on... Oh, cool. We finished it. I bet my life... So I'm trying to speak at the same time as not. I bet my life on RNG. And that's something you should never do. And I did, unfortunately. And that's got what got me killed. I bet that he wouldn't be able to hit me. And he did. So that, unfortunately, is uh, something you don't want to do. Like, if you're a one hit, you shouldn't ever, you know, bet your life on RNG. But I did. That's my own fault. That's my own fault. But now we don't need to play this anymore. So I'm going to take the equipment off. Save money. I know I'm using a little bit of gold, but you know what? We're getting ready. We don't need this tank anymore. We are going to take it off favorites. And we're going to throw this crew into the Centurion and try to get a good game real quick. It's, I know it's not going to be the greatest quality, unfortunately. But it is what it is. I haven't played this tank in forever. HE is bad in this tank. We'll go 28 PCR, 5 HE. Just to ha you know, HE is pretty bad in the tank, but it is still, you know, good for resetting bases and penning, at least doing a little bit of damage to tanks you can't damage whatsoever. Right? So, so I'll take it. But anyway. Anyone who's watching today, tomorrow we'll stream again. I know. I'm going to see if I can get my quality a little bit better, or at least my frame rate better. Um, see if I can get my computer to handle it. My laptop to handle it. But uh, if not, this is going to be the same quality. It's going to be at least as good as it is now. Or as bad. Yeah, at least as, at least as good, because it's going to hopefully be better. Um, and we're going to be playing all the updated tanks. And it's, we're going to have two streams tomorrow. Hopefully two streams. I want to have one early in the morning so that the Australians and Russians and all those other people can watch. And then I'm going to have one again at my normal time, which is around 11 p.m. Or 11 a.m. on the mountain time. So that's like 1, 1 p.m. Eastern. So we'll probably have one at like 5. Yeah, we're going to have one 5 in the morning, 5 Eastern, and then we're going to have another one 5 a.m. Eastern, sorry. 5 a.m. Eastern and then 1 p.m. Eastern. Hopefully. Those, that's the plan. That's the plan. Because I'm going to go to bed early today to make sure I can get that happening. I know I was super confusing, but whatever it is, what it is. Okay, so I'm going to quickly make a video, record a video with this. You guys have seen me do this before. We're going to do it again. And uh, we're not, I'm not going to count down this time because I'm going to record a video and I'm going to go in when I go in. And uh, so for a moment, it's going to be like you guys aren't here, even though you are, but I'm going to be interacting instead with the YouTube video, not you guys. So just give me a quick moment. But I'm sure if anyone comes in and asks any questions, you guys will do fine. But here we go in three, two. Hey guys, Clone Guy here, or the Null Trooper. And today, we're going to take a quick look at the Centurion Mark I before and after the 4.6 update. So right now is 4.5 tomorrow, 4.6 is coming out. So we're going to be pulling this thing out, checking out its strengths and weaknesses, and then pulling out tomorrow and seeing which of those strengths and weaknesses goes away. Um, we already know what should be happening to it, and it is a turret buff. And so we're going to quickly look at it in this view. And as you can see, um, the thickest this armor gets is 152, and it is on the turret, what you see now, the yellow. And then the roof armor, the forehead, is I believe 50 millimeters We'll look at it in a different armor inspector, one on the computer, so we can see it in full depth. 
And uh, yeah, that is an overmatchable roof, but it's going to be 88 tomorrow or in our next replay. So stay tuned for that. But other than that, the tank is the same. So let's just pull this out and see if we can get its turret armor into use and see what pens us and what doesn't. And then we'll do the same thing tomorrow, In but it's the same video. So later in this video, this replay, and uh, yeah, we'll see what we can do with the turret. But uh, we're going to launch, and then I'll see you guys when we find a game. Cut. There we go. So if you guys want to launch, launch now. I'm not counting in. Give a shout out to my friend watching you. Glenn Worrell. Hello, Glenn. All right, but now I'm going back into video mode. So I'll catch you guys later again. I mean, I can still see your chat, but I won't be responding. Three, two. We find ourselves on steps, which I, in my opinion, I believe is a great map to showcase the Centurion. Definitely. Because you've got turret armor. Well, you've got ridges to use your turret. Gun depression. And... Well, they're generous to us, give us a top tier game. This is actually going to be good, I think, because if we are not top tier tomorrow when we play this tank, it'll be good. Because then uh, we can really test. Because if 8s pen us now, but tomorrow we fight 9s and 10s and they don't pen our turret, it will really demonstrate what they've done to this thing. And it's really nice. And we're, we're going to have the, we have the same exact crew. Six cents now, and the same exact equipment loadout tomorrow as today. So everything's going to be the same. Everything is going to be exactly the same. So with 100% crew and just 6 cents and a gun rimmer, we have a 6.9 second reload, unfortunately. But yeah, we're going to go left. No artillery, so we can really work these ridges without having to worry about people dumping on us from the sky. So that'll be really nice. And we're going to hit the top of this ridge right here on the right side. It's, it's a little bit better, in my opinion. You can get your gun to work. Then we have a nice light tank who's scouting for us. This is good news. Um, unfortunately, they've got somebody in a bush. Plenty of bushes on this map. Plenty of bushes. We're not really going to hide our turret too much. We really want to see what it can do. There we go. That's, that's the plan anyway. All right, our team's pushing up. We're going to join them. Point my turret to where I think enemy incoming fire is going to come, and then back towards him. Hits my unit tracks. There we go. Nice of this thing to go 50 now. He's going to get a shot into me. Maybe? No, he's not looking at me. That's the guy who's spotting us, I think. I could be wrong. But this guy has come out here by himself. We'll put a shell into him, and then we're going to immediately get up here and try to get our gun depression working again. That's what you gotta do in these tanks. Get your gun depression working. Oh, Chiri. Oh, T32. Ooh, this is perfect. Shoot at me. I want this T32 to shoot me. We're just gonna let him aim at our turret. See? Okay. Let's see where did he go through? Straight through the mantlet. Straight through the mantlet. He's got terrible pen. 190, 198. So, keep that in mind. He's using the 90 mil, so he only had 170. And he went through. There's the S1. Okay, come on. Shoot us in the turret again. That guy just penned our turret, I think. No, he, actually, I gave too much of my side. And this tank is a tall vehicle. Something you'll learn very quickly. Also, this gun is troll. Come on, gun, come on, gun, come on, gun. Boom, right in. There we go. Turn where I think enemy fire is coming from. From the right. Chiri can't pen itself. Nice. It's pretty funny. Come on, shoot me in the turret. He misses, unfortunately. I am going to rock it back and forth, because that's how I would be playing this tank with the buff turret. So I'm going to play this tank exactly the same, just to see the comparison. Boom, he pens me in my turret again. And remember, he's got 170 pen. Bounce off his lower plate. It's okay. Where did he pen? Right next to it. Right next. Trust me, tomorrow, even shooting gold, that gun's not going to be going through. I mean, it can go through with gold, but it's less likely. Track him there. But as you can see, look, 170, when he's hitting me flush, it's going in. And that will not be the case tomorrow. Hopefully. Hopefully. But we'll find out. We're going to play the tank exactly the same tomorrow as we are today. 
That's the plan anyway. We're hopefully going to get a map where we can use our gun depression. Use our turret armor. Wow, we have a cluster of tanks back in our base. And now we're spotted. Okay. Is this Stark still alive? It is. There he is. Holy gosh, goodness gracious. That guy's getting an auto loader too. But you know what? We're still okay. We're still okay. And this is a perfect replay so far. We're definitely using this tomorrow, even if we die right now and we don't have a good game. It's not about having a good game, it's about demonstration. It's about demonstration. But now I'm going to play a little bit more carefully, I think, with my turret. Definitely. Just a little bit careful, because I still do still want to survive, and we've seen we've seen two shots with the 170 pen go straight through. I think that's that's good enough. I hate shooting light tanks that are moving. Stop moving. So I stand still, so I can pop you in the face. So velocity is not the greatest on this gun. Yeah, let's see if this guy can deal with us. Unfortunately, our gun's not the very Acting very accurate right now. Oh, we're not spotted. Oh gosh, this gun. Troll. Troll -lo 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 -lo. Come on, buddy, I'm helping you out. I'm helping you out. You can do it. My gun does not want to hit. But this is a pen, alright? This is a pen. Come on. No, it pulled to the right. Oh no, guys! But don't worry, we still have, we still have a chance. Oh, T29. There we go. Nice. He almost hit our turret. I kind of wish he did. And now it's conceivable that we can take a hit from the AC. So I'm, I'm wondering if we risk it. We tr risk it for the biscuit. Oh gosh, this guy. He's got a force field. There's a fortress still, and I'm afraid of the fortress. I'm afraid of this fortress. Oh, boy. Now we can't take a hit. Just kidding! We can still take a hit. I have no idea where the fortress is. Where did he go? I think he's on my roof over there somewhere. Oh, yeah, he is. He's right where I was looking. Uh oh. See, my tank doesn't want to go forward, so I gotta back up and go forward again. There we go. For some reason, my gears didn't want to change again. Didn't want to shift gears. Oh, this guy, that's right, he's got the Liva gun, right? So we can actually test this thing's turret armor, but we're just gonna kill him. And we're gonna. Well, you know what? This was a perfect game. This was a perfect game. I'm, going, I'm not going to lie. Our turret showed, demonstrated what it couldn't do right there, and that was take direct hits. Flush. So tomorrow. We'll be playing this tank again, and we're going to be doing the same exact thing and see what our turret armor will do. And so I will see you guys in just a moment. After we take a quick look. Ah, an ace tanker. I'll take that. I'll take that. We got string theory going as well. My mark is at 83. Nice. Maybe we'll three mark this sometime too. All right. I'll see you guys in the next replay. There we go. Fantastic. Fantastic. Our turret armor did not want to block anything. And that's okay with me. That is okay. How is the stream? Is the stream dying? Is the stream dying because of that? Can you guys still watch it? Do I have to restart the stream? Because now my computer is lagging. You guys let me know. Like, if I go like this, you I know it's getting low FPS, yes. But, like, is it s still the same it was, or did I just kill my stream?